U.S. Secretary of State Mike Pompeo announced Wednesday the launch of five new lines of effort under the so-called Clean Network Program. The program, claiming to protect America's critical telecommunications and technology infrastructure, goes a step further in suppressing Chinese tech companies. According to the five lines, Washington will seek to remove untrusted Chinese apps such as TikTok and WeChat from U.S. mobile app stores. It will limit the ability of Chinese cloud service providers like Alibaba, Baidu, and Tencent to access cloud-based systems in the country, and ensure that undersea cables are not subverted for intelligence gathering by China. Pompeo claims that Chinese companies steal U.S. technologies, collect data, and threaten U.S. national security, though he has never shown any convincing evidence. These actions will have serious consequences. Chinese companies will not be the only ones that suffer. Companies of other countries, including U.S. companies, will also face losses due to disrupted global supply chains and international scientific and technological cooperation. The actions will harm the interests of consumers of tech products too. The political scrutiny and threatened expulsion or forced sale of popular video sharing app TikTok by the U.S. government have already been met with strong objections from young people in America. And have been broadly criticized both in and out of the country. The actions will further discredit the U.S. investment and business environment. Pompeo has boasted that more than 30 countries and territories are in his boat, committed to exclusively using trusted vendors in their clean networks. It is obvious that he is trying to need a global network to crack down on Chinese tech companies and hamper China's development.